Okay, you guys, what's up? My name is Andy, and we are starting a candle vlog. Um, I have started this vlog six times, six different times since October, and it just hasn't happened because I keep chickening out and talking myself out of it. And then I realized that um, these are the fetus stages of my business, and I missed a lot by not documenting last year, and it's really good to be able to like go back and witness growth and just mem remember, right? <laughs> so um, we're pushing ourselves out of our comfort zone. New year, new vlog um, and doing this. I'm hoping this will be a weekly thing. More on that later. Let's let's get through the introductions. What's up everybody? My name is Andy. I am the owner operator. I just call myself a candle wizard. I am the candle wizard here at Thunderbird Avenue. That is my candle brand. We specialize in um, soy based candles. I do candles and wax melts and we do things a little we're a little bit nerdy here, we're a little bit queer here, um, and we just like to have fun. There are so many very serious candle brands that are out there for like really wonderful like decor and aesthetics, and it's not that we don't do that, we just do that in a way that is a little grown up but fun. I am a huge like Harry Potter nerd, I am such a hoe for like Twilight. <laughs> I feel like a lot of the time when it comes to like fandom and nerdy stuff, it's very, um, Oh, for lack of a word, cheesy. I'm just gonna say not as well done as it could be. Um, and I am 30 years old, I'm a grown up, I, this is my first home and I'm trying to like decorate it and bring aspects of like my personality into my home without it being like, okay, are we five? Did we get this from a McDonald's um, Happy Meal, right? So that's the vibe behind my brand. Thunderbird Avenue actually started as a not like an inside joke, but I actually made a Fruit Loops candle. <laughs> and I think earlier, very early in 2021, very early in 2021, I made a joke on my Instagram page and said that I should release this as a like charity project um, and call it Alphabet Mafia and release it for Pride. And that was exactly what I did. I released a trio and that was a really great success. We were able to donate a lot of money and, um, yeah, that was a good time. I've been making for about five years now, maybe a little more, a little less, I'm not exactly sure. I'm sorry if I keep looking down. I'm a little nervous here. <laughs> I needed something that I could do while I was still like watching my children. So, you know, put wax to melt, go change a diaper, do whatever we need to do. Um, and I really fell in love with the process. I love being able to just dream up things and make them happen. I think that's enough for the intro. We'll get to know each other as time goes on. We are exactly 10 days out from our Twy Hard series that we are really Releasing, yes, Twy Hard, as in our pets, Team Edward, Team Jacob, Bella. Um, all the dramatics, the 16 year old, like, <sighs> the 16 year old Twilight fan in me is losing her mind right now. <laughs> this is the first really big collection for me. I want to document it all. I hope you, whoever you are, even if it is just me watching this, <laughs> um, and I never decide to make it public, uh, I hope you. Come along for the ride and enjoy and um let's get into it okay so quick lay of the land if you hear what sounds like a washing machine that's because this is a home-based business currently um i did have a room dedicated to candle business but um family and other needs took over so we are here for now until we are finished renovating our garage this is my little shipping station i keep all of our important stuff there we are moving away from packing peanuts because those are not good for the environment this is where all of the magic happens i actually have our three twilight scents here these are fragrances that i am a no longer interested in carrying things i'm discontinuing since i just didn't like what do they say our eyes are always bigger than our stomachs that could not be further from the truth I've got my little wax melter here that my husband actually made for me. Y'all, don't buy, don't spend $150 on that. Go buy this little Presto pot here. They have it at um, Walmart for like 30 bucks. Get a little spigot. That's like another four bucks, okay? Put some JD Weld on there. You're good to go. Congratulations, I just saved you $80. Here is our current little situation as far as product goes. We are running very low on candles. Um, like I said, we are two weeks out from a drop. And these are my oopsies. These were actually supposed to be Bella. And um, I accidentally put pink instead of purple. So yeah, no, this is not, this is not a Bella purple. This is giving me more Luna Lovegood 
right? Maybe even a little Barney the Dinosaur. <laughs> So these are our three designs for our wax melts uh, coming out with the Twi Hard collection. I actually have been calling it a series, so let's say series. Our Twi Hard series includes three installments currently. We have Bella, Edward, and Jacob. I love the swirl on this. Just reminds me of his fur. Edward, of course, certified lover boy he needs to sparkle we did our first round of pouring here and then i have to label those i actually got a gigantic box of jars here because i was sent the wrong ones by the manufacturer so those i need to go through and inspect here soon and then wick and get started on pouring i wanted to redo our packaging for our samples I'll make them just a little bit here let me open this Okay, I wanted to redo our packaging for our samples. Um, I try to send samples with every order that we get. I just think you're buying fragrance online, right? It's a little hard. Um, it's a little hard for people to always kind of be able, I don't care how descriptive you are, sometimes it's just hard to be able to visualize. I'll be able to put a little sticker on the back saying what scent it is and the notes. See, the thing is, is I also do all of our like product pictures and stuff. So I get my nails done so that my fingers don't look mangled in the shots. And um, it's kind of hard to open things sometimes. Okay, yeah, no, these are perfect. I literally just add like a square um, so that it can either just be opened and sniffed or it can be popped into a warmer and actually properly sampled. But um, these are so cute. Obviously we're doing Twilight, so I'm in the very like Edward Shimmers kind of mood. Okay, that's very exciting. Next. I wanted to change, oh, too low. I wanted to change our shipping stuff and just kind of like presentation, right? I always just try and consider like, what do I want to get? How would I want my box to look? Like, what would I be happy with receiving? Um, and so before we were doing just kind of like simple mailers, there's nothing wrong with that, except like I said, we're trying to get rid of the packing peanuts. So I found this company, what are they called? This is not sponsored by the way. I wish it was um, Mr. Flush, if you happen to see this. <laughs> As you can see, I beat the heck out of this one trying to like test it and vet it and make sure that our glass candles weren't gonna get destroyed in here. My main thing besides obviously getting rid of the packing peanuts is also cutting down on fulfillment time because if I'm spending a bazillion years packaging orders as much as I love doing that and as calming as it is, um, my schedule just doesn't allow it to be. So um, this is a really great option. And I mean, like, these suckers are in here. So that's exciting. Anywho, that's really exciting. That's really exciting. I'm very much procrastinating putting labels on things. It's gonna be a little hard when I'm using my camera on my phone to vlog, but I also use this same camera to do TikToks and stuff. So if, if the next scene goes like this, just, just bear with me, okay? Thank you. gonna be just a quiet aesthetic video yeah no um literally those things just as, as as easy as they are to do and it would be very easy to just leave this leave the end of this video right just with labeling and calm cozy quiet aesthetic vibes um yeah no that's not my style here uh, thank you so so much for watching. This was absolutely the first vlog um, That I have ever done in like a long time Especially pertaining to like candles and such. Thank you all so so much for being here and by all I mean me Watching it seven times and then my dog being forced to watch it with me seven times and uh, Definitely probably my grandma. Hey grandma. Love you uh, <laughs> No, I just, I really want to document this whole process, start to finish, just kind of everything. Even if this brand doesn't blow up and just kind of is like a fun memory, which is not the goal. <laughs> um, I think, I think we tried. <laughs> we tried, but we're not putting that into the universe. This is, I mean, come on, we're, 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 we're building businesses, we're building empires. 
the Empire will strike back. Oh God, okay. Uh, yeah, thank you all for being here. I promise the videos will get better. The quality will get better. I'm gonna work on an intro and uh, try not to talk y'all's ears off too much. But um, thank you so, so much for being here. This will be a learning process. I'm so excited for this new vlog journey. And yeah, let's just have fun. Let's get to know each other. Uh, tell me something in the comments. I'm not sure what tell me tell me who's your favorite tell me tell me What's your favorite Twilight movie? Actually? No, tell me what Hogwarts house you're in. Okay. This is vital information <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next week Bye